marketing video, 3195 South Fox Street, Englewood, Colorado. Really good sized fenced in yard. This house is way bigger than it looks from the outside. Has its own workshop, four car garage. Nice little sitting area over here in the front. Nice open design laid on here. This is the first fireplace. There's also one down in the basement. Really nice job on all the woodwork in here. Nice open to the kitchen. There's a little work area here. A lot of cabinets. Pretty much all the way around. And it's a good size to eat in kitchen. Head back this way, we're gonna check out the bedrooms. First bedroom here. These are good sized bedrooms as well. Nice little walk in closet. And that. There's the next bedroom. This one's even larger. You can hear my voice echoing in this one how big it is. Hardwood floors throughout, just beautiful. Uh, this is a little bit smaller bedroom. It's a good size closet in the back there. You're gonna like the bathroom. The bathroom, they did a really nice job. Nice full size tub in here. A lot of upgrades with all the stonework, hardwood floors. Did a really great job in here. Also has a nice heat lamp as well, which is really nice in the winter time. I'm going to take you back. Um, we'll walk through, show you the workshop. Um, here's a little sitting room. Nice ceiling fan up here. You can see that up there. This is a great little area. This stove is going to be going um, and uh, the wall will be patched up. The owner is going to take that with them. Nice built-ins. Uh, there's also a stove underneath here that's decorative only. Let's head back and check out. You'll notice this is all enclosed from the garage all the way through. You don't have to go outside at all. Here's the workshop. This used to be a one-car garage that's been converted into a wood or to a workshop. A lot of space in here, tons of space up above. All your goodies. A lot of built-ins. Nice little area here. <clears throat> let's head back and check out the garage. This is a four car garage. Well, here, let's check out the backyard first here. A nice little sitting area. Um, this is, uh, oh, there we go, it's unlocked. So, fully fenced back here. Nice little sitting area where they keep the barbecue. Great space. This, and this leads us back into the four car garage. It's a really great size uh, garage back here. Tons and tons of storage room. Goes all the way. Let's see if I can get back as far as I possibly can here. That's how large it is. Um, has its own ventilation systems that you can see. So I, those could be turned on in the summertime to let all that hot air out. Two very large garage doors with openers. Shut the 
this here. That's the garage. Okay, I'll head back in. One of the other really interesting features of this house is it has two kitchens. So there's a kitchen upstairs and a kitchen downstairs. So if you have an in-law situation or another family member, they can have their own downstairs with, uh, there's a non-conforming bedroom down there. Well, let's go down and take a look. Okay, we're heading downstairs. It's a nice separate entrance right here, which comes in the side of the house. So get this door open. Uh, separate entrance right here. Just goes from the side. There's the air conditioning unit. It's nice and cool in here. Nice warm day today. Always nice to have air conditioning, that's for sure. Okay, close this back up. Everything's well locked up here. Good security. Okay, so we're coming downstairs. Let's uh, start over to the left. Um, this is the laundry room. Um, the washer and dryer are included with the unit. Also has a wash sink over here. Once again, nice attention to detail. All the stonework in here. Look at that. Beautiful shower right there. Let's go around here. Did a great job over here as well. Nice little, nice little bed. Not little, it's actually a very good sized bathroom. Um, we'll head over here to the left. So there are two rooms here. Uh, there's this room. Let's walk all the way back towards the corner here. And this leads into another room which is currently being used as a bedroom. Um, there, it does have a closet but it would be considered a non-conforming bedroom because it does not have an egress window, which all that means is it's too, too small for you to climb out of. So you can get light through it, but so that's why it would be considered. Okay, so that's how this is currently set up. A lot of space, so two, two separate rooms both being used as part of the non-conforming bedroom. We have some additional storage space underneath the stairs here. And this leads into the other kitchen. So this is the downstairs kitchen. It has a stove, has its own refrigerator. Once again, tons and tons of cupboard space. And that opens up into a full family room. So you have your cable hookups down here and you have another wood-burning fireplace. So great for heating the house in the winter, doing some supplemental heat, a little nook in the back here uh, for additional storage but once again this is completely open it's a nice open floor plan down here and good flow with all the extra amenities in this property it's going to rent really fast don't delay give me a call 303-884-3381 we'll schedule a time for you to come and take a look thanks